What's going on, YouTube? So this is the uh, painted project that uh, I picked up a couple of days ago. I've had some issues with the paint and things that uh, had to get resolved. For example, this mirror right here. It's got a little bit of fish eye in it. Kind of hard to see. But the paint's on there smooth. The orange peel looks pretty good as far as not having a bunch. I didn't have them paint the bed. I didn't have them jam it. I'll jam it later this summer, or I guess this next summer, spring, whatever. This is gonna get uh, rhino lined or bed lined or however you say it. And the big issue, may not show up on video, but there's a, a metal banner that goes across the back of the tailgate that comes factory. It says Chevrolet on it. Well, I removed that and whenever they laid the paint down, they didn't uh, hit it good enough, so it's kind of popping through the paint. And there's a couple of dents that uh, seem to be eluding them. So I'm gonna drive this back up there. They're gonna take the tailgate off. They're gonna fix the tailgate and then uh, get it back to me. Put it back on, or actually I'll go up there and they'll put it back on. He wasn't uh, upset, the guy that I, I bought it from. He politely blamed his crew, which ultimately I guess it is their fault. It's turned out better than expected. I uh, been asked about this right here. It's kind of hard to see, but they did a pretty good job getting down in there. And they didn't remove the bed, but uh, all in all, this whole project was about sixteen eighty-five. <laughs> One of the funny things I, I found it comical. You guys may not, but. Uh, Whenever I was driving home, I, got, I had a fast, busy signal from my turn signal, you know, the, the rapid click. I knew that they didn't put a bulb in somewhere. So whenever I got home, I popped out the uh, marker light and then the running light. There was no bulbs in it. Same thing for this one, no bulbs in that. But uh, I guess that's to be expected with, with today's help. I haven't checked to see if the third brake light up there has been connected properly with both the tail lights. They didn't connect the tail lights. I still got to put a put a uh, tag light in. Got the backup camera right there. But all in all, once we get the tailgate to my liking, I give it a solid nine out of 10. I used the Mako up on a Rockwell, about 83rd Rockwell, I think. And I used Sean as my service rider. So he's a pretty good guy. He, uh, he took good care of me. Just wanna make sure I get this tailgate problem fixed. So that's the paint update for now. I also have a lot of people asking me about what my truck sounds like, so I'll see if I can remote start it. There it goes.